I was dropping a fat nuke. By the time I was done, I realized there was no more toilet paper left. So I had to make sure the coast was clear, look under the seat beside me, no feet there. With my sweatpants down to my ankles, I just waddled to the stall next over. Right? <laughs> okay. I hear someone walk in and he pulls up to the stall where I was just at. I was hoping that the guy who just went in that stall, right? He wouldn't shit too. Because I didn't want to tell him that there's no toilet paper. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. So, okay, so okay, I, okay. I see his feet walk in. They're facing towards the seat. So it's like he's taking a piss. And then I see, turn around. <laughs> I didn't want to tell. Like, what would you do? in that situation. Yeah, I feel like both of your penises are out. You know, it's kind of <laughs> weird to be like, hey, bro, don't go in there. So I finish up. I wipe because my stall has toilet paper. And I go to wash my hands. And then I hear like the rotating <laughs> of, the, of the toilet yeah, paper. Yeah. And I just quietly hear... Fuck. <laughs> I just walk away. I'm like, oh. And then it's just a cycle. He goes waddles. Next guy comes in. Fuck. <laughs> and then the next guy. You know what you should have done? When you saw that guy go inside the stall, when you're done, you should have just came out, go to his stall, just bang on the door. <laughs> Excuse me, are you done? Excuse me, are you done? He has no toilet paper. 